when I first saw it, I did think this is absolutely magical. My name is Lewis Matheson. I'm a former teacher and now I'm a full-time YouTuber, I suppose. I make videos about physics for both GCSE and A-level students. I've been using the learning glass for a couple of years and I found it really, really important when I've actually been explaining my approach to physics problems. When I first was introduced to the, to the new smart uh, light board, I must admit I I just started grinning because it, it seemed kind of magical. I mean, the normal conventional technology with the current light boards is amazing, but I think there's so many ways that this new smart light board is, you know, just a step beyond that. It's something that I know when I'm using it, it's going to save me a lot of time in post-production. So I'm not trying to overlay graphics, maybe on top of something I've already pre-recorded. I can have it there from uh, maybe displaying some kind of PowerPoint presentation on the screen. I can annotate things. I can have uh, text that's already been um, actually typed out. So maybe a bit neater than some of my handwritten work sometimes. Uh, and also that you can have graphs, you can have graphics and things that move. I do feel that with the smart light board, it's, it's not maybe limiting me to kind of two dimensions. And I know that there's ways that I can, I can maybe try and bring 3D models to life on the screen. And I think there's ways you can rotate things, you can annotate things. And from what I've seen so far, I know that within a very short amount of time, I reckon I could get some spectacular things. And, and it does kind of look like magic. The other thing that I was really impressed with when I, I first was introduced to this was the fact that you can write on the screen, you can maybe uh, make that text smaller, you can maybe push it to one side, and then you can always come back to it later in that presentation or in the video that you're making. You can uh, maybe save that as a PDF afterwards. I think the other advantage is that you're not gonna be spending the time actually with a cloth, actually kind of getting rid of stuff you've already written. I can choose the color palette so it actually matches uh, the color coding I've got for different topics uh, of videos. I also know that um, I can have stuff where I can see it as I'm doing the presentation. So I can see the question in front of me. I can maybe underline uh, keywords. I could uh, highlight certain bits within that question so that a student who might be doing a similar question themselves, they can approach it in the way that I would be doing it on the screen. And also I think it would have um, it would really, really build the engagement with the audience. The younger people who might not always be that engaged with the topic when they're learning things, uh, maybe in preparation for exams, they'll realise that this technology is something that they engage with, they want to see where it goes next, and that means they're more likely to learn as much of that physics as possible. I think that for the wider educational market, I can see that this is the kind of thing that will kind of really build that one-to-one -one engagement between the presenter and the person watching that video. And I think it does really show the human qualities of the person presenting. I am genuinely excited to get my hands on a smart light board to actually see what it can do. And I know that the audience that I'm presenting to um, are gonna absolutely love it.